Joshua Graham. By the rivers of Babylon, there we sat down. Yea, we wept when we remembered Zion. Remember, O Lord, the children of Edom in the day of Jerusalem, who said, Raise it, raise it even to the foundation. O daughter of Babylon, who ought to be destroyed, happy shall he be that rewardeth thee as thou hast served us. Happy shall he be that taketh and dasheth thy little ones against the stones. Do you know what it means? Given those two choices, yes. In the best of all possible worlds, they will just leave us in peace. But they won't. I don't enjoy killing, but when done righteously, it's just a chore, like any other. Practiced hands make for short work. Good Lord knows there's much to be done here. Happy are those who do the work of the Lord. Zion belongs to God and the people of God. It is a natural temple and monument to his glory. When our Lord entered the temple and found it polluted by money changers and beasts, did he ask them to leave? Did he cry? Did he simply walk away? No. He drove them out. It is one thing to forgive a slap across my cheek, but an insult to the Lord requires... No, it demands correction. I and the dead horses are prepared to do what must be done to protect Zion from the White Lakes. And though Daniel won't accept it yet, there are many sovereigns who are also prepared. They may not be warriors, but this is their home. If you have a chance to speak with Daniel about this, ask him to consider defending Zion instead of abandoning it. He has good intentions.